The question is, what was I looking for for this? Uh, what was I looking for, and kind of like what I found through this through this experience. Um, so maybe I should talk a little bit about like our constraints uh, for our own protocol. Um, Life here has a pretty complex set of smart contracts. Uh, we do um, we have a we have a delegated proof of stake. Um, protocol implemented in uh, Solidity on chain, uh, which has which int introduces some um, some limitations around uh, the amount of gas that we have to spend. Um, so, for example, uh, we have this idea of rounds, and then um, at the at the beginning of a round, um, think of a, think of rounds as like a, a number of blocks, say 50 blocks. Uh, at the beginning of a round. Um, somebody has to initialize that round, and that requires a lot of calculation for the initialization. Uh, and and I found some really interesting solutions today uh, that kind of address that problem, kind of ranging from uh, solutions that will be uh, will be available in a couple months to kind of the solutions that will be available in a couple years. Um, so so like the POA stuff is really interesting. I think uh, the idea of like you can um, you can offload some of your smart contract computation onto a chain that's a little cheaper and then write the result back on chain um, with some compromise in, um, in the security of the calculation. But if you are smart about uh, scoping the, the calculation and making sure the attack surface is small, uh, maybe that's a worthwhile uh, compromise to make in the early days of a, of, of a project. Um, so that's a, that's a, like a, a solution that's a little sooner. Um, so the solution that's a, that's coming later. I think the counterfactual guys are working on something really interesting. Uh, I don't know if we would be able to use it because it requires every everyone to be to like open up a multi uh, multi sig channel to start. Uh, but I think state channels in general would be obviously a really interesting long term solution for a lot of these like. Um, Gas issues, um, and 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 another team that we work really closely with is the TrueBit team, um, because we use the TrueBit um, um, compute um, network to do our the validation of our uh, transcoding, uh, and we've been working with them for a while. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, I actually went to visit them at their hacker house and and created a prototype. So so that it's always good to see progress uh, from that team. So. Overall, it's been it's been a great experience. Also, learned a lot about things I don't know much about. Uh, the plasma talk was really interesting. Uh, I think I still have to uh, ask a bunch of questions to really understand how we need to use it. Um, but but yeah, it's it's been great. Yeah, do I think there is a scaling solution that I will implement? Um, absolutely. Uh, I think um, I'm, in I'm interested in doing a prototype for the POA solution. Um, it might require some um, re infrastructure, uh, like re architecting of our, of our smart contracts. But I think if we can, uh, if we can uh, separate out the Part that's really computationally intensive uh, and offloaded onto a POA chain uh, that might be able to save us, uh, save our users a lot of gas, uh, which might be a worthwhile trade-off uh, when we first start. Um, the later, like um, another thing that we're working on is um, implementing uh, a TrueBit um, kind of proof of concept with uh, with the TrueBit team. So uh, I hope we'll have something to show on that front. Uh, Soonish, um, and then I'm always looking for uh, new solutions. So I, I think when the when the uh, state channel solutions come out, I would love to uh, I'd love to uh, check it out and, and do a do a prototype. In six in six years and two years, six months. Six, okay. <laughs> uh, where would I like to see it? In six months versus in two years, um, I think in six months, um, 
hopefully we would have some like minimal um, plasma, uh, minimal plasma uh, prototypes that we uh, we can start playing around with. Um, I think the Funfair guys have implemented some kind of a state channel that I'm I'm, I'm interested in talking to to them more about, and I think that will be ready in a couple months, uh, which is cool. Uh, and definitely, I think the the POA stuff is going to be ready in six months. Uh, so so I'm, I want to try that. In two years, it's really hard to say because. The space moves so quickly, so it's hard to say what's going to be available in two years. Maybe all of our problems will be solved by sharding. Who knows? So my feedback about the event uh, uh, as a whole uh, and, and my experience, um, I would say it's pretty great to see like everyone kind of come together from all over the world uh, to this event, and and it's not like a hugely organized thing where uh, there's you know pro like a lot of programmed um, content and it's very grassroots. It really reminds me of um, this event that I went to last year. Which was the the Swarm Summit uh, with the with the Ethereum Swarm team, very similar vibe. Uh, a small group of people all working on something um, that's related. We all have uh, very similar needs and goals, and we're just kind of here, like trading notes, uh, asking other people what their approaches are, sharing our sharing our experiences. Um, and I think a lot in a lot of ways, that's a lot more useful than like you know going to uh, a bigger conference and just listening to talks. Because right? when you're at an event, I think the most important thing is, uh, the most valuable thing for me at, le at least, is meeting the people who are actually building things and, and learning from everyone and, and sharing, sharing our notes. Is there any particular groups that I think I will work with? Um, yes. So I actually just had a conversation with the Parity guys, uh, and they told me that their uh, their POA bridge will be ready in about a month. So uh, I will definitely be uh, pinging them in a month. Um, and you know, like I said, I, we already work with the with the TrueBit guys. So it's it's always good to continue that uh, that relationship and uh, collaborate.